Hey, this is Shirley Rocks. This is Pixel Piracy we're looking at. This, I picked this up for a couple of bucks, I think it was, on the uh, Steam store. Stupidly cheap, and it's pretty fun, so I thought I'd do a little review. Some of the uh, cheap, cheaper games that you can get that uh, you might not have really heard about. So this is Pirates. How can you not like it? So this is, we're doing a new game. I'm going to do a new slot. Okay, we're going to start game. Okay, so what do you think about Piracy Air? Yeah, so... It can either be, it's sickening, fascinating, or unpleasant. Hmm, I'm going to say fascinating. Okay, what's the most recent event that happened in the land? So we can have a great war, a plague, or a comet. We're going to have a comet, I think. How do you remember your father? So he was a brave captain, he was a lazy alcoholic, or he was a cowardly sailor. Let's go for a lazy alcoholic. Okay, and of course I'm male. Harry. So now we get to choose our characters. First of all, we want to change our hair. I want to pick a really awful hairdo. Um, I'm not feeling the love just yet with these. That is a ridiculous combinant <laughs> amount of hairstyles. Let's go for the like the baldy one. With the two, the two bits sticking up at the side. Where's it gone? Mm, nope, not that one. Come on, I want baldy head. Don't want that one. There we go. Right, so let's change the colour. So, we're going to have purple now. I'm tempted to just leave. Oh, yeah, there we go. We don't even want a shirt. We don't need a shirt. Let's change the accessory. So we've got a gimp mask, purple hair, no top on, and a pair of pants. Let's, let's find a voice that fits in with that. No, too long. That sounds like a zombie. I don't know what that sounds like. Jolly Roger. Yeah, that's good. We like that one. We like a good Jolly Roger. Okay, so we're going to defeat Peter, Su Peter. I thought that said Peter, Peter Sundre. I'm thinking of Peter Andre. Uh, Gottfried's Fart Home and Aaron Swartz and Tim Berners Lee. So let's begin game. So here we go. Here's my captain, here's my two crew, and this, apparently, is my boat. So, A and D moves you around, as the tutorial says. C jumps back to you. You can move by left-clicking the button. Moving the crew is something that completely flummoxed me at first. The crew's up here, and this is all grouped. So this is one, two, three, four, five, six. So, three is ship's crew, so there you go. And then if you right-click, it will move. So first of all, we want to go over here to the um, the tavern. We've not got much money at the moment, we've only got 200 gold. Save the rum. So the voices here do drive you insane. Now you've got these stats here, you've got health, hunger, morale. Morale is when you pay your crew and boost your morale. Hunger is when how hungry you are. You can come back here and eat food when you get hungry. And health is just what it says. It's health. So let me just go into the menu because that, that it will drive you insane. The, uh, the voices and that's having. So first of all, we're going to go do ship setup. And we're going to go ahead and get some food. So we're going to get some watermelon and drop it on the ship. There you go. Three lots of watermelon. Okay. So you press ship setup again to exit. So now we've got the crew. Let's uh, hire someone new. Let's get three members of the crew. There we go. So we're going to go to your crew. Now select crew member by clicking on the avatar. So you've got extra stat points. So you basically, you can level up your um, crew and uh, captain as you go along. So strength gives you bigger damage. Vitality gives you more uh, HP and armor. Uh, intelligence gives you passive XP and bonus ranged damage. Actually, I think that's misaligned because dexterity you would think would be Hmm, I don't know actually. I guess intelligence is range damage. Uh, I mean, if you're watching this, you know you know which one it is. I don't know if that's actually just misaligned because there appears to be nothing for luck. 
<laughs> so we're gonna uh you've got i've got to uh learn the cleaning uh skill apparently to progress in the tutorial so let us find the passive we want the cleaning ability so we need to click this and learn it teaches how to clean which gives you allows you to clean the ship plus 25 percent skill per level excellent okay now press your crew on the left exit crew manager um we're about to set sail make sure that everyone is on the ship but first of all before we do that i've got some skills here still so let's uh let's level up the crew a little bit let's let's go for high high damage with these so i'll do space jump straight out so now i want everyone to get back on the ship so here we go we're coming we're about to set sail we've got three members of crew now yeah that, that bit with the movement at the start that, that looks so easy but that got me so frustrated when i first started playing this i could not figure out how to do it so here we go we are now going to set sail so we're going to get the world map up which is a accessible by pressing space and pressing world map and here is the uh travelable area so ships indicate pirates different danger levels as you can see so uh you basically as it says here double click the icon you want to sail to so i can sail there which is an island or i can engage pirates now i'm going to engage pirates because i want a better i want a better boat this is actually the screen of you actually the top right is loading what as you can see one of my crew i think has just killed another member of crew so we're going to engage them to see if we can get a better boat so here we go so it says i've got three crew still oh myself and two members i don't know what happened to him he just died so we're sending a crew over there and myself there we go we're fighting them there we go so once you've actually captured um a ship like this you can then sometimes you're gonna loot them but there's nothing really to loot on that one so we're going back to the boat and then we're clicking that which is plunder there you go so you get the gold so now you need to press space back to world map let's try and uh let's go to some of these different ones so we've got another island there's a town there which is where we come we started from so let's sail to the other pirate thing because we want a decent boat that looks like the sun from the teletubbies okay we're gonna engage them so another one that's not really that much of a better boat than ours Ooh, and i've sent the captain over first by mistake so let's uh there we go quickly come back again so it, it, it is it is pretty fun this like level up the, uh, the ships and getting money and stuff so we are still looking for a better boat so let's go to danger two bigger danger equals bigger crew to fight i think and also bigger chance for a bigger boat okay we're gonna engage them oh you scary sea dogs so let's send the crew over first and then us because if you die it's game over so <laughs> okay they're all fighting here we go seems to be an awful lot you can do with the fighting but we're gonna capture this now so this is now jolly our boat roger. jolly roger so there we go that's our boat now now if you look at the uh, the health on him his health's quite low so it does actually increase as you play but um i'm just trying to think if i should go let's go to an island i'm trying to think how i can get my uh, health back at easier let's go to this uh, island that sounds like the oldest pirate ever so it's 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 been a pretty fun game so far it's uh th this is like a, an island you can explore i'm just uh open these ones and i get a health back you can actually see now one of them just said they were actually leveled up so what you want to do is keep an eye on this 
and then level them up when you can. So there you go, that's that one leveled up. Let's level this one up as well. That's it, that's all we can do. Um, I don't think his health is going up quick enough, so let us go to the map. And we're going to go back to the town, so let's go back there. Let's go back there and I'll show you the uh, the hunger and morale. Oh, these. Now, if you notice this on the ship, I don't know what negative effect this has, but those things that look like steaming pies are, uh, they're not quite steaming pies. <laughs> they're steaming something. So we're going we're gonna to head to the uh, tavern there. Now, these will actually go to the tavern and uh, start uh, eating food and drinking and costing you money. So if you look at me money, it will start going down in a bit. I'm heading inside anyway, I want to get some grub, so watch this uh, the bar here. So as you can see, they're picking up the food there. Don't know if there's a better way of getting the uh, hunger to go up than that, it seems to be slowly going up. Let's send the guys in and see if they can eat. Jolly Roger. Jolly Roger. Jolly Roger. Yeah, Yes, so the food's not actually going up there, which is a bit weird. So there's a whole... Ooh, animals. I've not even unlocked animals yet. Um, let's have a look at the ship set up. So you can buy all sorts of hulls and decor. Ooh. Deck cannon wind. Do these cost money? Oh, so you can actually... Plonk your stuff on. That's pretty cool. What about misks? There's nothing else in misk. I've got water there, uh, melons. Oh, you can actually. <laughs> this is a. Uh, you can actually create your own um, pictures on here if you're actually any way, in any shape or form, good at drawing, which as you can see, I am just absolutely amazing at drawing. So there you go. Look at this. That's just... I know you're thinking, that isn't something you've just drawn, that is Photoshop, but no, I do. I have actually just drawn that, so that is actually my, uh, that's actually my flag now. I don't know where the flag actually appears because it doesn't appear to be on the on the uh, the ship. Um, I don't really want to be on the flag. Press C to get on my captain. So there, there is like weapons and stuff you can get. They are pretty. They are pretty pricey though. Let's see, for instance, um, yeah, the cheapest thing there is like two hundred, which is a spear. So you can equip you. I'm assuming you can equip your crew. Let's let's have a little look at it because I've not actually bothered equipping an item just yet. So let's let's have a look. Um, <gasps> ooh, we're gonna get that animal cage. Actually, I think that's just skins it does. Yep, that's skins it does. Oops. So where's my booty? So food in there. I can buy more food, fruits, and stuff like that. Um, and items. Interesting. Oh, excellent! Teaches a pirate how to swim. Uh, bandages stop bleeding. Um. Okay, so let's uh, let's buy some of that. So, can I then put that on my ship? So I've got a little bit of food. So I can't actually equip the uh, bandages. So maybe they're just equipped normally. So I don't know how you get rid of the stuff on your ship. Just waiting for all these guys to come back to the ship. Where's my captain? There they come. Uh, there is buttons down here to do stuff. So that's move, attack, interact. Uh, that's the plunder one. That's capture and that's carry. So uh, we're going to sail off. I'm going to actually pay me crew, which... Uh, let's see. So there we go. Let's... Uh, let's Quickly, if you look at my morale there, 81. Go to your crew. 
click on crew, pay all. Now you can see my morale's gone back up. Jolly Roger. So we're gonna set sail. We're gonna uh let's go and explore an island. Jolly Roger. I don't know how you clean up the ship though. I think it said one of my crew had the cleaning ability before, but doesn't appear to be using his ability. So as you can see on here, there's an oyster. You can attack these. There we go. There's some some uh, unfriendly um, neighbours here. Okay, so Buff Buford Silver doesn't want to die. He wants to join your crew. So let's uh, set, let's accept him. Okay. Okay. Well, this is a treasure chest, so I want to go over to this and then interact with it. Which is that one. Here we go. We've got some elixir and some gold. These are crates, sometimes have uh, money in. Um, this is a chicken's nest. So I think you can. Is he can carry out? Interact, try. There you go, so just drops a load of chickens, which you can then kill. Kill all them, collect the stuff, there we go, let's escape. So you see, the health the health does eventually go up on the, uh, the characters, but it's pretty slow. So let's set sail to the next uh, destination. So, hmm, so we've been there. Oh, interestingly enough, that's a town I've been to. There's another town here. Let's go to Sylvan Lake. See what's there. Nice little shark under the water there. Okay, let's all go and get some shore leave. Looks like the crew are already two steps ahead of me and going that way. Jolly Roger. I don't know if the crew actually go there to get the health back or not. Let's kill some chickens. Let's send, them, let's send everyone to the tavern. There we go. Let's hopefully our hunger is going to go down. Jolly Roger. Okay, I guess, I guess that's all we'll get in for the hunger, so let's, uh, let's escape. Shiver me timbers, har. I mean, we could, like, we could actually buy another member of crew, but we're not going to bother just at the moment. Come on, Captain. Let's so let's see if we can take on a bigger uh, pirate ship. Okay. Let's go to the map. So we're looking for what's past Danger 2. Let's see if we can find Danger 3. That sounds like such a depressive pirate. Okay, let's engage them. Okay, interesting. So this is a pirate ship that looks like... Is that better than mine or not? Let's send them over. Actually, this will help clean my ship if I just get a new ship. Okay, we're firing our guns. Excellent. Ooh. Oh, it's a messy fight. It's a messy fight. Oh. Okay, let's capture. Let's capture there, though. I don't know if I... Oh, maybe I should have captured the um, the tre the chest first. Dope. All right, let's go back to the town, because I think we are pretty much... Uh, injured from that encounter. Yeah, he, he, he looks like he's about to cark it. Alright, lad. Okay, let's get some shore leave. 
So it's, it is a bit of a pain having to walk all the way over there though. But as you can see, you can build up your uh, little pirate family. That's a Jolly there you go. Jolly Yeah, I'm just, I'm just looking to see if they go to the tavern if he gets his uh, health back. I'm hoping he does. I think it must be as the uh, as the level up. Let's uh, let's check out the. Um, it's him that's got the. So HP regen. So let's put him on high vitality. In fact, let's bunk up. Let's do all the, the um, agility on them. Uh, try doing a bit of that passive XP as well. More strength. More that. More dexterity. Okay. So I think basically there's not a lot I can actually do here at the moment. I just need to get to the ship. These are going to heal up themselves. I don't really, I don't really think there's an awful lot you can do to actually uh, heal heal them up. To be honest, it just seems to be like a passive regen. Jolly Roger. So it is quite interesting the fact you can like you know upgrade your ship to different ships. So I'm gonna go ahead and I want to go a bit further out. So let us actually let's go over here. Let's see if we can get more towards the edge. There's nothing on that island. <laughs> Excuse you, pirates. I don't know. What, I don't know what food. This, I think these watermelons aren't really agreeing with them. So as you can see, you've gone over here, and it's now it's level one danger, which is not very good. So we're going to take this level 1 pirate on it, it'll probably be pretty easy to kill I imagine. Oh, this is taking a long time to load. Okay, we're going to engage them of course. There we go, they shouldn't be any problem. There we go. There we go. That was easy. Easy to kill. And you can see someone's just leveled up then by the look of it. So we're going to plunder that ship. There we go. So there you go. So you get better money for doing that. So we're going to go to the edges. So we're going up still. I don't know what that... I, I, I can assume what that is. But what is that one? A silver thing. Right. Let's see what these are like. Okay. Send the captain over a second. There we go. Okay, that cap that captain's actually dodging then. Ooh, there we go. Right, there's not an awful lot we can actually there is. We can screw the end and then head back. Let's wait, at least we get back. I want to check my ship because actually we were going to do that first of all. We want to do ship setup. Have I got any food on my ship? I don't believe, oops, I haven't got any food on my ship. So uh, let's get to world map and we're going to get to a town. Don't think I've been to, have I been to Waterloo before? That seems a new name to me. This is a embrace. So we're gonna go over here and get some food. Now he's just leveled up then. I don't know how he's just leveled up when he wasn't actually doing anything. Jolly Jolly kill these with extra XP. Right, that's all I'm killed. We're gonna go over here. 
Okay, so we need food. Let's get some food, so... We can get meat, which is eight servants, or we can get citrus, which is two. So I think we're gonna get sea biscuits, because they're nice and cheap, so... Oh, actually, if you look at that... Hmm... So we have actually got watermelon, but you can't... You couldn't actually... Oh, hang on. Wait a minute. I've not got the watermelons on board my ship. Right, let's jump timber. back to the uh, captain. Jolly Roger. Jolly Roger. As you can see, I can get more crew now, so I could just go... I want you, you, you. Let's get all that. That's going to do for all my crew. Let's uh, see if I can level any of these up. Okay, so... Massive... Massive strength. More massive strength. <laughs> let's uh let's give him higher luck. Okay. Go. So, we need to get over here. I don't know how you clean the boat though. That's my only problem. My boat the my boat definitely has a poop deck on it. So we're all heading back now. We've got a bit of a bigger crew, we've got seven crew, so let's uh let's check this seven crew out against someone. Okay. Oh, I was about to say we're all safely on board and we're not. Oh, there you go. They're actually eating the food that's on the boat now. Ah, so that's how you do the food. Who says playing games isn't educational? So, um, let's go and take these pirates on here. Oh, I think the crew's attacking each other again. I don't know why the crew's attacking each other, so we're going to attack these. We're going to attack these, and I think we're going to get a new boat because this boat is filthy. Um, my crew is not. Ooh. Don't. I want them to attack, and then I can just like super. There we go. That's better. Right, that's going to be our new boat. Jolly We're taking Roger. it. We're taking it over, it's cleaner. Okay. I think that is going to be it for this video. I'm just going to leave it there. So uh, if you if you enjoyed seeing me sailing the seven seas of 8-bitness, uh, leave a little comment below. Uh, be interested to hear from you guys and girls if you played this video yourself because it would be awesome to, uh, you know, hear from you what you think of it do you still play it do you like it um that's it for this video and i'll see you in the next video this is shirley rocks and i'm signing out